Welcome to the ancient majestic town of Hampi in Karnataka, India. During the four years I've lived in India, no place else has been recommended to me as much as this famous backpacker's paradise. So many people have promised me I'd fall in love with the magical vibe in Hampi, but I remained always a bit skeptical about such a tourist destination. I wanted to travel the real India. However, road tripping across South India seemed like a perfect chance to see what the fuss was all about, so we decided to drive from Hyderabad to Hampi. After a lot of research and suggestions from friends, we came up with a few great ways to experience offbeat Hampi and just chill there, also enjoying that famous hippie escape from the rest of India. after a very long day of driving so we just chilled uh, chilled in the evening and then went to take a good long sleep because we had been like so tired from the, all the shopping in Hyderabad and all the driving so here we're just going to chill and enjoy the atmosphere which you can probably see is just awesome and so beautiful and calming I already love this place even though I haven't seen that much what's this Vinod? We stayed in the Virupapur village across a river from the main Hampi town and temple site. This laid-back hippie scene was the perfect place to just chill and relax, but more about that in the second part of this vlog. the like hippie side of Hampi and the actual Hampi town. We're waiting for our boat ride so we can get to the pretty old temples there. Like this one here in the forefront is a uh, forefront is a functional temple. And yep, then once we reach that side, we're gonna uh, rent bicycles and explore the magical beauty of Hampi. This boat is gonna take us through this like very narrow river. The UNESCO World Heritage Site of Hampi Temple Town used to be the capital of the Vijayanagara Empire. It's crazy to think that all these temple ruins were the center of power, the real India, back in the day. It was built by a Finnish king. <laughs> Finnish people aren't kings and queens. We even like when we were considering with our independence becoming a monarchy, we were trying to get a freaking German king. Oh. The distances between all the temples in Hampi are so long that it's impossible to see everything by walking on a short stay. We're renting bicycles for the day and I just love cycling in Finland, but I have to say that I'm quite nervous of this. I've never ridden a uh, bicycle in India because I just like absolutely hate bicycles without like uh, foot brakes. And yeah, I'm afraid I'm going to die today. So, Yana, what say you about the bike? I already told the camera that I'm afraid. <laughs> yep. This might be my last day on this earth. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Bicycles were a fun, cheap hire for the whole day. A quick way to move around and definitely the best way to see the temples and everything in between them. Of course, we still needed to park the bicycles often and experience many sights on foot too. Follow the dog. Look what we have. Just go! Oh. How did we get an elephant? Oh. Oh, go give. Uh, we should. Should we give him some money too? Yes. 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 Really cool. Uncle, Anna. Oh, I got 
me so happy. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Damn it! Uh, I'm getting so sunburned. Yep, me too. So you can't see it on me, but yep, I'm yeah. suffering. What say you, Johanna? Ah. How's the bicycle ride going? I'm still alive. <sighs> oh, the silence. There are tons of touts around every corner trying to sell overpriced rickshaw tours but we don't like paying for autos that much or seeing places stuck in a vehicle. Many people also just stay close to the few main temples but we wanted to lose the crowds and explore Hampi on our own terms. After a while all the temples start to look the same, unless you're a total history geek for this period. Boredom kicks in. Eventually, it becomes even more fun to be riding the bicycle and experiencing the road. Lots of hard work, Johanna, today. Yep, you deserve your food today. Today Today's only day that you, I think you deserve your food. As always, the best moments are on the unexpected journey, not at the destination. Oh, go through them. Okay. <laughs> 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 yeah, that was actually more scary than the cars. Hmm. Oh, there's a bell. You don't honk. No bell. Huh. Uh, do you feel like we have to go to the temple? No, we don't have to. Yep, that was <laughs> quite a lot. Even when you're completely under the spell of humpy magic and bicycle fun, do remember to get back to the riverboat by 5 p.m. The day has almost come to an end. Otherwise, you might just have to have one more adventure on the way back to the hippie side.